Hello everybody, Rich here again with another rip and review. Uh, today we're doing a Bowman U blaster box. Uh, got this in an order from Target, threw it in my order of Bowman uh, baseball blasters and said, I just wanted to give this a try. I've seen some kits of this on the uh, on Twitter and Instagram. I haven't actually watched anybody open it, but it's very similar to the Bowman baseball cards where you get the first uh, logo on it and uh, they look like nice cards. Uh, not licensed, so that's kind of a uh, downfall of the product, I would say. Uh, obviously not being licensed won't be as popular, but uh, they are nice looking cards. So I'm going to go in here and get a first peek at them today, uh, live. So we'll start opening this. And uh, you get 28 cards total here, as you can see on the side. And four of them are an exclusive pink refractor. You can also get autos from these. And you're really looking for the big quarterback name, CJ Stroud. Uh, Bryce Young, that was probably the top two. Uh, DJ Yuga Gagale, whatever his name is. And here's your odds here if you wanna pause that. Prospect autographs there. Uh, so it looks like one in 75 packs for the autograph. Hopefully we'll uh, get lucky. And we'll get many packs here. We get six packs. Oh, excuse me, seven packs. And we're gonna get uh, four, four cards per pack. So similar to <clears throat> like a prism football, where you only get four cards per pack, you get a limited number of cards. This was a $20 purchase at uh, the Target. So let's get right into it and uh, see what we can come out with. I don't have super high, I wouldn't say hope, but I'm not anticipating anything spectacular out of this. This is just uh, purely a fun rip and see what we come up with. So if you see the design here, very much like Bowman Baseball. Chris Olave there, I guess, because he's a rookie. He's not going to be considered a first. Uh, he was just drafted, obviously, by the New Orleans Saints. So the first ones are going to be the guys that are still in uh, college. So we got a Connor uh, Baslick. we got a, a first pink behind this one. I'm going to pull from, well, this one looks like it's got five cards in the pack. So let's pull from the back here. Jake Hayner. Skylar Thompson. And our pink. It is a first. Let's see what we come up with here. No logos. It's tough to tell who it's going to be. We got ourselves a tight end. Jalen Widermeyer. And just kind of take a look at the back here too. Very... Uh, pretty much the same as Bowman uh, Baseball Chrome, which, once again, I do like uh, very much. Um, <clears throat> if these were licensed, they'd be spectacular, in my opinion. And for 20 bucks, if they were licensed, it'd be even better. That's a good price point for them. I think Holly boxes run around $150. I just have the guaranteed autos in them, but I don't want to get that deep into it. Uh, well, this is odd. It's a Derek Stingley first. So I don't know. He was just drafted. and I wonder if Olave had a card previously, but that doesn't make a lot of sense that he wouldn't be a first He's, as well. Xavier Worthy. Looks like Texas. I just wanted to take a look here. It doesn't really say anywhere on here what college they go to. So I think that's completely eliminated from it. Got ourselves a Graham Mertz. He's Wisconsin, I believe. I'm not as familiar with some of these guys. 
Well, here's one of the top running backs probably next year. Beyond Robinson. That's definitely Texas. Once again, interesting that it's not a first pair of, uh, first logo on that. Not really sure what the rhyme or reason behind those are. You definitely want the chrome uh, first parallels. Those are going to be the most popular ones. Got a Tyler Van Dyke. And a Chamir Dyke. There's a joke in there somewhere, but I'm not going to say it. Um, pull from here. J.J. McCarthy. And we got a regular chrome. Oh, we got we have an autograph. Wow. To 199, Chris Rodriguez. That's an unexpected surprise. Looks like one of the, uh, this looks like a Ray Wave. I don't know if we can see that in a camera. That's pretty, I do like the Ray Waves and the baseball. So uh, he's a running back. Looks like maybe blue. Could that be Memphis? I'm not sure, but let's take a look at the back there. It's not a quarterback, um, obviously, but that's not bad at all. That's a good, uh, get an autograph out of a blaster box for 20 bucks. You can take that to the bank every time uh, to be 199. It is a sticker auto, which more and more sticker autos these days. Just uh, have a regular top loader here. Let's see. I think these are going to be going there. Perfect. Get it down in there. Actually, it's too tight of a fit. I'm going to have to do a 55.4, but I'm not going to because I'm running out of 55 points and I want to use those for my Bowman baseball cards because we're getting a lot of hits out of those. And we have uh, Kashan Boot, and this is uh, LSU. We're at number one there. Uh, it's going to be good, but I'm going to predict he is not a Jamar Chase level talent. Get this guy sleeved up since he is a wide receiver. We don't sleeve pink tight ends, but the wide receivers we will. All right, so that's, uh, we've still got, there's only three packs in. We've got four more to go. Let's see what else we can pull. Right now, I'm going to have to go ahead and say, uh, pull-wise, it's a success. Getting an autograph from 199. And uh, we'll see if we can get some color out of this as well, just a regular color. Uh, John Menchie, once again, he's not listed as the first. J.J. McCarthy, is this Michigan? Could be a Wolverine. Doesn't say. Put him over there. I just want to take a look real quick. I think it's one. I don't know if there's a. Doesn't look like there's. It's a refractor. It's just a regular chrome. Uh, Sauce Gardner. First Bowman, and there's a Spencer Rattler first Bowman. His value is not very high anymore. These are a little bit more difficult to open than Bowman Baseball. There we go. Kind of wish I grabbed one more box of this, but... Oh, Bo Nix, first Bowman. Casey Thompson, first Bowman. I'm gonna pull from the back here, leave that. Well, once again, get some extra cards, I think. Majay Sanders, he's Cincinnati. Tyler Fregel, Fregel. And our pink, oh, we got orange there. Is this gonna be Justin Ross? No, oh, got fooled. Emory Jones, first Bowman. Quarterback, looks looks like the Gators there. Really was hoping for a Justin Ross. Want to get one of the Clemson guys. 
but maybe the next two packs. Next to last pack here. <clears throat> I think I'm going to end up with like 30 cards here because I've gotten two with the extra five, uh, extra card in it. Uh, Malik Willis, first Bowman. Nick Starkle, pull from the back here. Another, this is just the paper, uh, Kayshawn Boot. Oh, well, got another one in the back here, another paper Emery Jones. That's interesting, getting some of the same names out now. Got ourselves the first Bowman. I don't know why I'm doing that. I just guess I'm saying do this to see it's a first Bowman, but you just can't tell who it's going to be because there's no logos. Oh, Majay Sanders. So we're definitely pulling a paper and then the chrome of this, so the correlation might be a little off in these. I'm waiting for a Chris Rodriguez paper now. But let's uh, last pack here. Let's see what we can come up with. Derek King was signed to the Patriots on the practice squad in the, or for offseason as undrafted free agent and then immediately cut. Sean Clifford, pretty sure that's Penn State. Pull from the back here, and like Jalen Widmer. And there's some sort of insert here. This is Florida State, Zay Flowers. Let's take a look at this insert. It is... He's a wide receiver, and that's definitely going to be Florida State. The inserts in these, that's one. And let's take a look here. We had another one somewhere in here. Those are the two inserts that we pulled. Not really a fan of these um, compared to, say, Bowman Baseball's inserts this year. So uh, we'll take a look here. we got one, two... We got four uh, chrome uh, pinks. And then we got the JJ McCarthy. And I would say probably Emory Jones. Oops. Can't get a hold of them. Uh, that's probably the best pink one we got there because it's a quarterback. You never know. One great season. Sort of like Joe Burrow shoots you up the charts and gets you on your way in a career. So overall, um, fun rip. I do like the looks of the cards, as I said, even though they're not licensed. Uh, Bowman uh, is is always fun to rip. Uh, autograph can't be upset about that. Uh, in this, and uh, probably won't do any more of these to be honest with you, just because they're not licensed. And I want to focus on with the. Panini Prism coming out and some of the other football that are finally going to be released over the summer. I'm going to focus on those and uh, more Bowman baseball, obviously, but I would recommend if you, you like to rip these and want to have fun or if you have kids and want to rip something fun that looks cool, go ahead and uh, get a box of these. Grab two boxes if you can. Uh, like I said, I get them off Target, so if you have the red card, you can get a little 5% discount there and uh, have at it. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. Uh, go ahead and uh, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Uh, follow me on Instagram, KingRichMoney4712. Uh, you might just see a picture of that card out there. Just uh, just because I did pull an autograph, I might take a picture of that one and throw it out there since I haven't uh, thrown a picture up in uh, quite a while. So I do appreciate it again. And uh, I'm not sure what my next video is going to be, but uh, as a new product comes out, I will make another one. So thank you again. Take care. Bye-bye now.